you know, the traditional school, it's, it's, it's very general, I would say, and they would not give them the personalized attention that we do give them. So from my perspective, you know, they feel more comfortable coming to a technical school, you know, and having a trade. Not everybody, you know, was born to be a doctor or to go to the traditional college. So, you know, we do have to understand that. And that's why we have the opportunity to deal with this type of individuals. They actually come over and they want something short something fast, and something that's going to be able to give them financial stability. The academic department um, is in charge of maintaining student retention. We have to make sure that the student is coming to class scheduled for a specific term. I have to follow up with the students on a daily basis on who's coming to class, who's not coming to class. I have to call them and follow up with them to find out why they're not coming to class, what's going on. You have to meet certain requirements in order to be able to graduate. So you have to meet a 67% graduation uh, attendance rate in order to be in compliance for graduation. So you also have to meet GPA, 67%, and the credit hours or the credits per program that are required to be able to graduate. Those are the most important things. So we work directly with the student to make sure that they're coming to class and that they're actually getting the information, the knowledge that they are looking for when they enroll here in CBT. I am 22 years old and I chose that career specifically because it has very many benefactors to it. It brings lots of jobs. It's a great program. The client list is very swell with that. And if you have to move for any necessity, you can always find a job in a new place. I chose a technical school because the teachers teach in a different way. It's not always book. It's a book and, and practice. And they work with you one-on-one -on -one most of the time instead of a big group. It's much more quicker than a four-year college. You get out of here in two years or like in this program that I'm in, in eight months. My expectations is to own my own company and being able to give back to the school that helped me in the first place to get my company and get where I'm at and where I want to be. I've been doing this position for six years. I actually help employ the students. So I've seen the students go from straight from an eight month diploma program, which we have here, going into fields like engineer at hotels, working for AC, both residential and commercial companies. Twice a year, we do what's known as an institutional advisory committee, where we bring employers from the community to discuss with us changes in the field. There's always things constantly evolving, constantly changing. So we update our program to the constant evolving things in technology, which means our students are up to date on, on the latest technologies, which is another amazing thing. In CBT College, we actually have AC units and we have electrical units and they actually play with what you might say play with real toys and they learn basically things from out in the real field and they have the practice of hands-on practice here on our campus. They also do field trips. They'll go to actual companies, maybe a residential home that has an AC that's broken with an instructor supervising them. They actually figure out live how to, how to do things. So they get a lot of hands-on experience. It's not just reading a book and that's it. We always have job fairs. We'll do about two or three job fairs a year. And what we do is we bring employers with hiring opportunities and they get to speak to a lot of students at the same time. As you know, as a job fair is, we'll bring students and graduates from previous graduation dates and they'll come to our job fair and hopefully get hired.